Is it okay to keep walking with plantar fasciitis? Hey guys, if you don't know me, my name is Tony Maritato. I'm a licensed physical therapist, and today I'm talking about walking or running or staying active even when you have plantar fasciitis symptoms. So plantar fasciitis is basically pain either under the calcaneus, which is the heel bone, or sometimes it runs along the edge of the heel bone. It's typically described as pain-free when you're sitting, sleeping off of your feet, but when you take those first couple steps, usually in the morning, sometimes if you've been sitting at a desk for 20, 30 minutes and then you get up, you take those first couple steps, it could be excruciating pain, stabbing, piercing kind of intensity. But then typically it'll resolve or decline in intensity as you get moving. Sometimes you'll learn strategies to manage the symptoms. So maybe before you get up, you'll do some toe curls or different exercises to mobilize the plantar fascia. But most commonly, it's extremely painful when you first stand up and start walking. Typically gets a little better after you get moving. But then sometimes it could get worse if you spend too much time on your feet. So the question today is, is it okay to keep walking even when you have plantar fasciitis? And I would say the typical answer is yes. Now you need a physical therapy or an orthopedic evaluation to determine why you have plantar fasciitis because it could be something related to the plantar fascia, but it could also be something related to the vascular system or the bone itself. And we wanna just rule out any kind of bone fractures or other problems that might be contributing to the symptoms you're feeling. But once you've been cleared by a medical professional, typically the advice is to stay active, put stress through the sensitive tissues because the plantar fascia, that kind of connective tissue typically responds positively to stress. In other words, when it is being worked, when it is, it's increasing your blood supply, it's facilitating fluid exchange. So if there's an active inflammatory process going on, the best way to support the immune system to heal that kind of process is with gentle range of motion and activity. So most of my patients that come to me with acute plantar fasciitis, they're typically safe to continue running, to continue walking, to continue their normal daily activity. And in fact, if you're not being active and you've rested for a day or two and the symptoms haven't really resolved, the typical course of action is go to the other direction and start to work the tissue a little more. There might be something going on mechanically, which you would wanna see a physical therapist for, or there might be something going on chemically, like your immune system or your hormones could be changing and that could be contributing to some of the symptoms you're feeling.